Good morning everyone, so today is a really exciting day, so I've done my makeup, I curled my hair but I'm actually going to straighten it instead, I've decided, but today is the day that we go to London, so I'm actually taking one of my friends called Meg and you'll see her in the video as you go through it. Um, but yeah, we're going to London and we are going to the Angel Meetup. Um, so it's like a little pop-up shop where we get to see all the loungewear, all the collection. And we also um, get to meet Ellie and Connor, which I am really, really excited for. She's probably one of my favourite YouTubers. Well, not one of them. She is my favourite YouTuber. Um, I came across her on Instagram to begin with and then I started watching her on YouTube and her positive energy, the way she battles life, everything like that. She's an amazing role model and I'm so, so thankful for finding her. So I just want to repay the favour, go see her and, you know, say like, hi um and sort of put name to face because even though like it's really it's really hard to explain but i have no idea how i'm actually gonna feel when i actually see her because it's gonna look really weird because i'm so used to her like on camera so it's gonna be really surreal actually seeing her in person so yeah i am really really excited the time you probably see this video will probably be a week after. If you haven't already, don't forget to go check out my Instagram. I have actually changed my Instagram. I have gone to my main account just because I've already got loads of pictures on there. I've already got some of you guys following it. And instead of trying to make a new Instagram account, I mean, it seems silly. Just I might as well use one account. Less confusing for me. But there will be loads and loads of pictures on there from the weekend as well. And it'd be really great for you to follow me on there because then if I'm not uploading, you can also catch up on what I'm doing on day-to-day -day life. Yeah, I'm really, really excited. So if you are really excited for the video as well, don't forget to give it a big thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe if you are new. And of course as well, if you're watching this and you're an angel, you'll know that if you're part of Ellie Darby's thing. Don't forget to subscribe as well, you know, girls supporting girls. So let, leave me any comments down below as well. If you are an angel or you've come over here from Ellie, leave a comment down below. If you are on YouTube as well, I will subscribe to you back. Um, same with Instagram. If you follow me, let me know that you've watched my video and yeah, I'll, it'd be really nice to meet some of you as well. So yeah, um, I'm going to stop rambling. I'm going to go get myself ready and... I shall see you in a little bit when we get to London. Meg. Meg. Tip your head a little bit. Get 
so we have just got out we're really hot it's like what the heart rate's got to like 140 odd got the goodie bags got our little angel my little shower angel collection stuff we'll probably show you like everything when we get home do a bit of a review and everything on it but yeah it was really really good wasn't it she Super. was lovely so nice yeah really like friendly i know you hear it from everyone when you like see it online but she's literally like how she's met like is on camera isn't she so You're prettier in person as well yeah definitely so that's a bonus and you'll probably see from the clip before obviously we've got her in saying stuff so yeah and people are now starting to stare really weirdly so i'm gonna put the camera away and we'll catch up for oh, really no smoke <laughs> got the cheeky angel bags in the background there We are back. Um, I've put my hair up. Um, to be fair, this is a couple of days after uh, London that I'm now sitting down to do this. And look a lot paler. Um, hair's up and I'm all snug because it's raining outside. But before I carry on, I feel like I'm just going to just go through everything that happened on the Saturday and go through all my loungewear and everything that I got. But I think it's a bit unfair, me in jeans and a fluffy jumper, I think I need to be in the loungewear. So what I'm just gonna do, I'm just gonna change into that. And we're back in the old loungewear. What do I start with? It was really surreal actually seeing her. I think, or I said that in the first clip anyway, that I don't know how I was gonna feel, um, whether it was gonna be exciting, nervous and things like that. Um, I can 100% tell you I was so nervous. Um, my heart rate looked about 140, so it was basically like I was doing a workout. Yeah, I mean this was the the bag that we got with all the goodies in it. When I say the goodies, I mean the loungewear. I wanted to get the tea and biscuit set, which is basically like a fluffy joggers and like a really baggy top that you sort of tie up around your sort of just under your hips but they went very, very quickly, which to be honest, it doesn't surprise me because it looked incredible. I really wanted this top and I thought, you know what, I'll get this in the Grey Joggers instead. And the Grey Joggers had sold out. So they said, well, actually, why don't you have a look at the creamy yellowy joggers? And I was like, well, I don't know because like, I don't know if it'll match and everything. And then one of them, I think it was Layla who was actually wearing them. Um, she showed me them and I was actually like, oh my god, that actually looks really nice together. So I got both of these in a size small, which is about a size 8 to 10. And I wouldn't change them, they are completely oversized. I mean, the top is on the tighter side, but it's really hard to explain because it, it looks like it should be sort of like a gym top. But the, the feel of it is really, really soft. It like, it's tight, but it's a comfort tight which I'm really, really funny with anyway because I don't really like really tight things. I don't think they're normally very flattering, whereas this is incredible. It's so lovely. Um, if I wanted to, I probably could have sized up just because of the top half. But again, I probably could have sized down as well if I wanted a little bit tighter because you can see on my arms anyway, there's quite a lot of material left. I've also actually folded the sleeves as well because they are actually quite long. Yeah, I mean, all in all, this wasn't actually that bad. And for a decent top, like a loungewear top, this was 28 pound, I believe, which I don't think is bad for the quality. Um, the zip is really, really good. I don't think I'd ever actually have the zip up though, just because it does not look as nice. But it's a really decent zip. It fits really well. It's cozy, it's comfy, and it's everything that I would like in this top. Um, Coming on to the joggers. Now, the joggers were £28, which when I say to a couple of people, they're like, oh my god, that's so expensive. But thinking about it, I have a pair of Top Shop jeans. Top Shop jeans. I have a pair of Top Shop joggers, and they were about £25. And the quality between them and these is beyond me. Like, these are so soft, they feel like. I don't know, you won't be able to see it on camera, but they literally have like a really nice cotton feel to them. They're the exact same inside, if not softer. And the size of them is so good. So these are a size small, so again, a size eight to 10. And I have to do them up because if not, they're gonna fall down. But at the same time, they're so loose. They're not tight on the waist, but they flatter my waist. 
and they are all in all really really incredible these are honestly amazing products um they are so so good and i'm 100 so glad i got these joggers in the end because to be completely honest i probably wouldn't have got these joggers if they didn't have the team biscuit set in because i really want the team biscuit set but now i want all of this like um the next one to come on to is basically all the goodie bag stuff and everything that we've actually done on the day so the first thing you get is a little goodie bag and you get this really cute little letter from ellie and it says Hey Angel, I hope you had an amazing time at our first ever Angel Collection Party. We plan to do many more of these up and down the UK, so keep your eyes peeled and celebrate our future collections. Connor, Harvey and I can't thank you enough for coming today and being such a kind, loving and supportive Angel. You truly mean the world to us and I'm so happy you could be here today. Keep living your best life, boo, and remember to always reach for the stars. Lots of love always, your friend Elle. And to be honest, like, that's her in a nutshell, like she's so nice, she's got such a positive energy. And then the fact that she's done like a little goodie bag as well. So the first thing was this triple chocolate, the gourmet brownie kitchen brownie. And I actually haven't had mine yet, which is really weird. Everyone who's had it and it was amazing, it was really, really yummy. So I think what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna have that in a little bit with a cup of tea or coffee and chill out for the rest of my afternoon. The next thing was this hair clip. So this was by Bella by Jade, um, and it's like bespoke jewellery and hair accessories. Um, what I'll do is I'll leave all their details down below as well, so if you do like any of these, you can go check them out. Um, and this is literally just like a little flower clip. So that's the flower clip, and it's just one that you sort of just like put into your side of your hair here. The next thing is my hair. So recently, you probably find it really weird that I've actually got my hair up, because I never have my hair up. But... Um, look at this scrunchie so it's a really cute dusty pink scrunchie and this also came in the goodie bag as well and this one was from bond banana boutique so i will leave her details down there below as well and i can't recommend a scrunchie enough i like a scrunchie and this is probably one of the best scrunchies that i could have got um my hair is really thick and it's also quite long as you can see and i only have to turn it around twice and it doesn't even leave a kink and it's still a scrunchy shape so as you can see it is i love it i think it's amazing and she's now got a few other colors coming out she's got a really nice like dark burnt orange one and i really really want to get that one so i cannot wait till payday because i will 100 percent be ordering that yeah. one so we also got a woman's best protein shake and a tester i haven't tried that one yet so it's a chocolate coconut one and it sounds incredible um, next week I am hoping to go to the gym a couple of times so I will probably be taking that with me to try that out and I'm sure it will be incredible and I'll end up ordering loads so keep tuned for a better review on that and I think that's all that came in the goodie bag. It's just a nice little touch like to be completely honest seeing her was enough but the fact that she actually like took the time to get a little goodie bag to say like, like a thank you for coming I thought was incredible so yeah. It was really good. The actual day was amazing, so I sort of explain it roughly just so I don't babble on too much. But basically, we turned up, um, our session was the one o'clock one, so it was one o'clock till quarter to three. Uh, we got in about half one, um, just because there was quite a long queue to get in. Um, as you go in, you would have seen in my pictures, it was a really nice flower wall. Um, I liked some clips in over me talking as well. Um, and then to the left you had Ellie and Connor and you sort of queued up to go see her and take, get your pictures and everything. Um, at the back there was a massive spread of food, so it was loads of cakes, uh, sweets, chocolates, everything that you could think of and that was from Everlasting Detail and oh my god it was incredible, it was so nice, it was such a lovely spread. Yeah so you had all of that there, you had the really gorgeous lights above you, you had the sparkling floor and then you then walked out to go onto the balcony and it was an amazing view that like if you looked out and just to the left you were just in the London Eye and you also were around the corner from Buckingham Palace like it couldn't be any more in the centre of London and I don't go to London enough to appreciate it so when I went it was really really nice um, we then obviously saw Ellie and Connor there and spoke to them for about five minutes you then sort of go across into the other room and that's when you could there buy all the clothing as well so you had the gorgeous angel lights lit, lit up and then you could buy the clothes as well and 
again obviously i didn't get the ones exactly that i did want but i wouldn't change that because these are incredible as well they're so soft so cozy and i missed the pre-order so i'm gonna have to just wait until the new lot come out and i will definitely be buying the tea and biscuit set and then they also had a magic mirror and this mirror was one that took pictures so this is what we done the pictures are not that great because we couldn't actually figure out where the camera was there you go can you sort of see it says them two plus that and then it also just says about the angel meetup and to be honest it was really really nice i did enjoy it it's just like even these pictures will probably not go anywhere but it's just a nice little memory to show that we went and we i got a copy meg got a copy then also um ellie got a copy and you got to put it into a book and you also got to write her a message as well which i thought was really really sweet yeah. that was pretty much our day in a nutshell and it was a really good day i did enjoy it definitely if there's another meetup i will be going i um, might even take billy just because why not and yeah i loved it and it's made me want to pick my camera back up so yeah i'm just really really happy so i'm hoping to start loading a video up once a week i think next week what i might do is a sit down video just to go through a life update everything that's happened recently and explain everything in a lot more detail um, and why i stopped youtube for a little bit um as so i think that will probably one that i get my cup of tea out sit down with you and go through why i will catch you in the next video if you haven't already don't forget to give us a big thumbs up and if you are new please don't forget to subscribe i will be uploading a video every week and if not don't forget to check out my instagram so i'll leave all my details down below but my instagram has changed it's now amy.newman stay tuned check me out on instagram don't forget to leave me some comments down below and i'll make sure i reply to your comments and i shall see you in next week's video bye